Some of y'all need this harmony in your life. Get you some Palo Santo. I got a question. I'm healing, working on me, and discovered some things about my past that I feel like don't nobody need to know because it's my family business. So I'm going to say this. If it is my job, I wasn't gonna, I was gonna say whom, but if it's my job to break the generational curses in my family, and I'm the only person that can do that, why do I need you to come tell me anything? What that my mom was raped by some dude that was extorting my deity? for money you did that to protect me uh but how you know i ain't know that as a kid how you know that that ain't the pain that i'm carrying as a kid because when families um have family secrets you know um the parents tend to tell the kids don't tell nobody so you sticking your nose in other people business really make you look like a nosy stalker, cause it don't got nothing to do with you. You 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 wasn't there. I'm so serious when I say this. Like how you want to how you know I want to hear what you got to say. If I'm clearing myself and I'm getting rid of what's in the past and it's dead, what happened happened, and now the energy that's carried over can be extinguished, and I don't have to deal with that no more. Where you fit? Y'all, I'm, I'm really glad I started this. At first, I was dreading this shit. I was dreading going through the motions. I was dreading going. My fucking stomach hurt. Because I got to stick my finger in there and open this shit up and clear it out. And I'm trying to figure out where the fuck y'all fit. Because the more I pull layers back, oh, okay, so I know why this pain is here. Because you done stuck a piece of wood in there. You can't stick no wood in somebody else's flower and think you're going to blossom, you fucker. You don't belong where you at. You don't belong in my business. You don't belong coming to tell me about some shit you think was protecting me. And for my own good, I don't want to fucking hear it. You know why? Because it don't got nothing to do with you. You don't need to be the messenger. How you know I ain't know already? Why you think I got a fucking attitude? Is that your business? Because, I mean, if I'm clearing shit out and I'm healing for it from it, why do I got to share that with your ass? Why do I got to share it and part of my healing with you? And you ain't my spouse. You not my confidant. You not my spiritual guardian. You not my fucking guardian angel. Y'all gotta understand when people say so where are you from? With none of your motherfucking business, cause it don't got shit to do with you. At the end of the day, don't invite yourself to a party without an invitation. If ain't nobody volunteering no information, what the fuck are you inquiring before? It's not putting money in your pocket. It ain't gonna make you smarter and it ain't putting food in your stomach. It's wasting your time and knowledge. My job is to break this fucking curse right here. People attaching themselves to other people's auric energies through pleasure and desire, thinking that they can fulfill somebody's wants and needs and not even fully know the difference between the two. Do you know the difference between pleasure and desire? Do you know that those are two different things? Do you know what you desire and the pleasure that you are putting out as far as that energy to bring it forward ain't the same? Sound like y'all going to jail because every time I get on here to talk about y'all, it be sirens. Ambulances, fire truck peepers, police peepers. Somebody need 911? There's too much for them. The reality and the truth coming out now. You starting to actually see that I'm really right. Because when I get done doing this, I am going to be ready to leave. And I ain't going to want nobody to accompany me or take their hand and put it in mine. I'm not going to want that. So Y'all keep telling me I need love. Well, if I needed love, then you'd have gave it to me. You wouldn't have spent 
a majority of your time trying to kill it in me and take it from me. Now y'all in darkness and you want somebody to help you see through that. I'm cutting all the lights off. You'll be able to see my chakras shine luminously bright because I want you to see. And they're going to come pick my ass up because it's going to shine bright for them. Not you. I pick and choose who I give energy to. Side up is going to drip in that drown. I am the electric company. The electrician, the lightning bolt handler, the light bearer's wife, whatever you want to call it. I am the light. And I got the knife. And I'm going to shine bright. Because that's how I am in my life. Side was out.